Oh guys, I just fucking shit my <laughs> I can't hear myself now. <laughs> bubble. Oh, oh, oh. Anyways, yep. Let's oh. turn that down. Now I can hear myself better. It probably gates it. It probably gates it. Oh, I did a thing where I was laughing. <laughs> Chest hurt, it, like was st- such a strong pain that went from my throat down into my uh, my chest. Yeah, thank you guys. Thank you guys thank you, so thank much. You. Thank you, bro. Thank you. Welcome back, everybody, to Beyond the Pine. Beyond it's the return of Beyond the Pine. The pine. It's an icon returns thirty years later. Oh my god, you thought we would never come back You wouldn't stop asking for it You thought we'd never come back and you weren't wrong And we're at good old James DeAngelis' house again Yes guys, we're at my house I renovated Lucas's house uh, Into a podcast <laughs> studio He's sleeping on the streets now Guys, let me in <laughs> Where's oh, my bed? It's okay <laughs> <laughs> Where's my bed? I'm hungry <laughs> I can't eat oh, anymore. Oh, fuck yeah. What's this? Looking like a streamy, James. Oh, you forgot? We didn't. We'll yeah. make you remember. What is it? This is a, just a streamy award. One of the highest accolades we, <sighs> we could have ever thought to get. Very low in comparison to what we're capable of, but the highest one that the industry offered us, and we took and we won it, the biggest one ever. ever. And let's just get a round of applause for the streamy, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Unbelievable! <laughs> I can't wait I'm until so we can put our own oh. like sound effects on that. We could have, we, we just... could have, and we won't. We will. <laughs> you guys know us. We always do exactly what we're going to say. We're going to do with the podcast. Yeah, guys, we're going to have a guest on next week. <laughs> guys, we have some big plans. Okay, l- look, little huge plans for the podcast. Okay, look. First of all, it is fucking so good to be back. It <sighs> yeah. feels we need let's fun get, and fresh. Let's take a sec. Yeah. All right, let's mute James. What's up, guys? I didn't mute you. I muted the wrong track. I can't hear anything. Really? Yep. I didn't do anything. Well, oh, you're full of shit. I can't hear anything. Is it recording me? How about now? No. Is it recording me? Yeah. How about now? Now. Now. Yes. It's working now? Yes. Dude, I didn't even know what button that does. I did not even know. I don't even know what button that does. But, guys, it's great to be back. We missed you, (laughs) and we've heard all the cries and the pleas all the cries of pleasure you guys sound like a bunch of fucking babies man and the the unbearable pain of (laughs) of imagining a life without us we've heard it all i'm just kidding and we've ignored it for months easily yeah and then with no struggle and 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 look honestly what had happened was a couple weeks ago we were we were fucking around jerking me and clay we were jerking but but be graphic man okay (laughs) (laughs) <laughs> Come on, be graphic. All right. Well, we decided just a couple weeks ago. While we were fucking e- Yeah, we each decided other. just a couple weeks ago, you know, it's time to get the old band back together. You're goddamn right. And thankfully, Steve, the whole band no, was, kidding, was, was there because it was me and Clay. Yeah. And Steve is not here. He's not here. I know. I, 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 I re- they all at home. You guys go. freaked the fuck out. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> <laughs> dude, check this out. Dude, dude, check this out. This is so funny. <laughs> no, 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 no. You gotta check this out, dude. Oh. <laughs> wait, wait, no, just check this out. Wait, yeah, yeah. Whoa. No, just check this out. Check this out. <laughs> oh, what's, right? What's dude, make me laugh, dude. Fuck yeah, man. Welcome back to the show, dude. Welcome, my guest. It's been so long since oh, you've been here, dude. dude. It's great to have you back. I'm not putting up with your bullshit anymore, man. I, I, I'm just already like bracing myself for the fact that this podcast is basically going to be an hour-long intro to the podcast. We're going to keep being like, totally. nice. <laughs> well, we have, look, it's a brand new podcast set. I just built it. Yeah, there's some things so, to kinks you know, to work out. I got to fucking, I'll be reprimanding Lauren for that. She was in charge that of everything. Fucking bitch, she was in too. charge of building and putting together everything and- I want to you know? hang on. I just want to roll back, just because I'm having so much fun too. But you're totally, totally right. We should fucking, we should be. Let's take a sec, because it has been so long, and we stopped doing the podcast. I guess why did we stop doing the podcast? We should tell them. Huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Why don't so, you start us off, James? What happened? Basically, was, what happened was, <laughs> go ahead again. I was gonna say. I wonder if he, if he even knows. My if I even know. Yeah. <laughs> why are we stop? <laughs> <about him? laughs> Oh, we got busy. Well, yeah. And so sad. We got busy. We got sad. And look, 
Don't worry about it. First world problems. I was so sad. Fuck yeah. <laughs> I was so sad because I didn't get any more I can't trickies. do my podcast. Oh, I can't do my podcast because I have too much depression. No, I remember though. Um, It is true. Uh, we, we stopped doing it because we we felt like it was a fucking chore to do. We didn't want to fucking do this for you. Ugh. No, it was like we didn't want to do it. We always had fun while we were doing the podcast, but then... You know, we just, it was like we were just like fucking doing the absolute goddamn bare minimum Mm -hmm. just to fucking barely get it done. It's one of those things where when, and it's like a job, like if you have a job that you get specifically only for money (laughs) and you have no um, passion or interest in it at all whatsoever and you, you do that job, but you get so complacent with (laughs) <laughs> you get so complacent with like, thank you guys. I know. Sorry, that's disrespectful. Thank you. Keep going, dude. You get so complacent with the. T- <laughs> the uh, how many times like, am I gonna say complacent? <laughs> keep going, Holy man. shit! Keep going, dude. That you you. <laughs> oh, keep going, oh, man! <laughs> Don't you, stop. You get so complacent. Don't stop. Tell them what happened, man. Be and serious. That you that. And keep going, man. It's that's what sad. happened to us. It was something that we weren't creatively fulfilled doing. We weren't interested in it to a point where we were going to put any more effort into the podcast other than the bare minimum that required for us to turn on our cameras, call each other on Discord, press record, then talk for an hour, throw it into Premiere, and fucking get it. <laughs> So we, At least you're talking to them. Keep going. At your, yeah, what you're saying yeah, matters. Yeah. I just no, it does matter. It does matter. It does matter. It does. It does. And I know you it can matters. think I disrespect it you. It matters. It does matter. I matter. Ow. Who does? This is going to be a very funny game. I love that. I love that. <laughs> we can take turns um, each time. And then what happened was, because, you know, Clay and I are creative people. We love creating and we like loving what we do and caring about what we do. And we're fucking good at and it. we're fucking good at it, bitch. That's a weak fucking. Come on, better one. And we're fucking good at, at it, it, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, that was Steve. <laughs> real, real. Um, uh, and we had ideas <laughs> back when we were doing the podcast. We had ideas where we we're like, oh, you know, like it's it would be so easy for us to do, to put any more effort into this and make it better and make it something that we were proud of right um and you know a lot of that like most i'd say 90% of that fell on to Clay's back because he, God damn it, would never post any TikTok clips or yeah. any social media clips. And you wouldn't either, which is funny. Right. But you, the reason why we didn't hire somebody to do it, and we had so many people who wanted to well, do it. Well, that was at the for, very last 10% for, of, almost, of the podcast. No, no. Yeah. Guys, let's let's see yeah. in the comments right now. Um, I'm pretty sure that it was at least seven to eight months before we ended the podcast. We had put out that, that call to action, that fucking <laughs> casting call to some... <laughs> We put out that fucking notice for editors wanting to fucking do TikTok clips. Are you kidding me? And Clay was like, no, 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 I'll do it. I can't pay. I prefer to pay somebody 30 bucks a week to I do it. I couldn't, man. I have $30 in my name right now. And neither can I now. Uh, and here we are. So you eight understand. Months. How long ago so did we stop the podcast? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I understand. I'm just giving you shit. Word. I know, dude. Yeah. But How I long ago? It. I never pound, bro. Oh, because it's so white. Yeah. To pound. So what, dude? <laughs> dude, fucking noise get it. <laughs> <laughs> um, how long ago was it that we stopped? I could probably find out. I would out. say two months. It's been more than that. Are you kidding? I've been through a time warp of depression. Who? What do I know? You actually think it's been two months? Yeah. I don't know. I, I literally don't know. <coughs> I feel like I've been in LA for a month or two. Did There's we no stop service here. before? Did we stop before I moved back to LA? It's been, I'm pretty sure there's no service in here. That's going to be a problem. Um, it's not. Hmm? Oh. Well, I already have Wait, all the other. There, well, there is. I have service. I have two bars. Yeah. LTE. Yeah, I have one bar LTE. That's not going to load anything. You think mine won't load something? I promise you. You want to bet, dude? Verizon well, never the, fucking lets me down. Go to the channel. Go to the channel and see when we uploaded the last pod. I think it was at least eight months ago. SP7. You think it was eight months ago? 
I think it's been what the fuck? six months, eight months, maybe. Oh, they have Wi Fi. Oh. Um. Anyways, if you want to try connecting that to the Wi Fi, maybe because that's the only important thing. Yeah. Um. And I'll I'll I got something to say. Listen, guys. <clears throat> We've always wanted to fucking bring the podcast back in a way. Even even the day we ended it, we're like, I can't wait to bring it back. I can't wait to bring it back. Um, no, but of all seriousness, stopping the podcast was uh, a <laughs> relieving thing for us mentally and with uh, life. When life throws you lemons, sometimes lemons taste like shit. But sometimes it's lemonade, baby. Um, yeah, but we we it was like it's always been like a, a bittersweet more bitter than sweet but it like a, ne- a necessity it was necessary because yeah, look, we needed because to like it was, refresh it was, ourselves it was but the, we wanted to come back yeah it was the you know the burnout from it and like yeah. but also other things that we were Probably going on in our own lives and um you know we can tell you guys a little bit about it we're not going to get too much into our personal lives like right now unless it happens naturally but unless i don't really feel naturally. like it um <laughs> but you know we we both had things and have since had things going on in our lives that, you know, we struggle with. Mm -hmm, And, mm -hmm. you know, it's like, we're already so busy with our own jobs and just trying to make ends meet. And I'm waiting for this goddamn strike to end. And it's, it's not going to fucking end. And literally fucking not if I have anything to say about it. Just put out a statement today that was saying that, um, the fucking don't, don't, this is serious. I'm not doing anything, dude. WGA put out a statement that was saying, or no, SAG put out a statement that was saying that they were in negotiations with the fucking studios and the executives literally fucking walked away from the table. They got up and left during negotiations. They didn't even make a counter. Those fucking b- ball sucking fucking losers. This is a good time. These fuckers, dude, they, they are so bold and so fucking cocky and arrogant to think that what they're doing, they're doing it so boldly and so publicly. Their mm. disrespect for the fucking unions and for the whole industry. We want your money for now until the end and of it's, time. And it's about because SAG's doing it about the uh, the usage of like AI and, and CGI, like replacing actors. So basically, right. contracts signing away your likeness, so that yeah, we put you in one movie and then we can forever use your likeness. You should only be able to license that particular piece of footage. Not Dude, your likeness. It's wild, the shit. But because then you could the, use the that fact that they just like get up, ways. they're like, mm, no, and just get up and leave the table. Awesome. So then you're just gonna stonewall the whole fucking industry. Yeah. Continue to fucking just put this shut down on the industry. Yeah, it's smart. It's smart. Dude, fucking just I'm so pissed about sure it. And that's been it. affecting my life very much so because um most of what I do is production. And so when production shut down and I can't fucking do it because the, the, the other bigger studios and bigger unions and bigger shoots aren't, were happening then a, yeah, sure. I'm not union. So I can work non-union shit. Like I always do. But now what happens when all the union workers can't work, then my non-union jobs, I'm competing with 80,000 fucking people out of work. (laughs) God, dude. (laughs) But anyway, so there's that and other things. Um, Yeah. Yeah, I'm back in LA, baby. Clay went through a breakup, and here we are, dude. So I've just been not feeling good for a while, but I'm trying, baby. I'm trying, and you guys can eight relate. Eight months ago. Too. Oh fuck! I'm f- eight months ago. I'm fanny farting. <laughs> I'm having a fanny fart. Oh, well. Look, you want to talk queen? about your situation at all? Yeah, I mean, I don't want to get into it like in depth or anything, mm-hmm. but like, yeah, but you don't you, have to. people go into breakups and uh, just because like you, the, most of you are great and then there's so many of you fuckers that pry and stuff. I think people watching now are probably going to be do- dope people, but um, yeah, I don't really care about you guys, <laughs> the bad ones. <laughs> the good ones are good and the bad ones are bad. <laughs> um, yeah, just, I mean, you guys can relate. It's, I'm not unique. It's mm-hmm. a breakup and then it sucks. Yeah. You know, and it's just trying to like feel like yourself again and uh, I don't know. Yeah. I'm trying to think of like a good way to, I'm not like not down to talk about how I'm feeling and, and shit like that. I, just, I don't really know how to describe it. Just depressed, I guess, you know? That's fine. That's literally it. Mm-hmm. And it, it, I just like can't do things. I, the things I need to do, I can't do them. Um, and then I'm like not texting anybody at all. I haven't like texted my parents and like, for it's who god knows how long now and it's it's just like self-destructive behavior that i fucking love well it's it's (laughs) (laughs) 
I think that with you, it's actually <clears throat> like as difficult and hard as it is, like growth is painful. Growth takes time. Yeah. And you got to go through this to then get to the yes. other side. So I think that just this like the is, chicken that crossed the road. Yes. You have to go through shit to get to the other side. <laughs> the chicken um, has to go through a, a, a breakup and just feel bad. Yeah. No, honestly. And that's exactly what it is. And it's yeah. bringing in other things, you know, like whenever you're in a, a low point, yeah. Um, or you're generally in a, in, you know, you're, you have depression, like other things come in and, and, and other negative things will be a product of that. And you'll feel down about yourself or you'll feel like not excited or, or motivated or fulfilled creatively or like whatever, like mm -hmm. there's so many things, mm -hmm. but I'm like, and I'm in it too. Like my, <clears throat> I got news that my mom has cancer last year. Um, and very difficult to deal with that. Um, there's, I'm not going to use the board. Thank you. Um, there's, I wouldn't do that you know, you. a history, like, you know, everyone has a history with their parents, um, good and bad relationships, you know? And so there's a history that I have with my mom. And so there's layers of, of complexity and difficulty dealing. Dude, and, we have the same mom sort of. Yeah. Um, dealing with that and everything. And it, you know, that's, um, it's heavy, it's heavy stuff, mm -hmm. you know, like, it's, it's, it's hard to focus on things like working mm -hmm. or like creating things, um, or even just like day-to-day -day life, like being happy and having fun and stuff. It's hard to always focus on that. Like, I feel like my tank is never full. Mm -hmm. You know, I feel like that's what depression is. Your tank is never full. Mm -hmm. You're always like 60%. Yeah. And so mm -hmm. you, you use your energy and your fuel much faster and it's also like shitty fuel yeah it's like the worst possible gas station you could have stopped at. <clears throat> i fill mine up with i have things that aren't even fuel you mm -hmm. know what i mean like that's the self-destructive behavior literally mcdonald's fucking not sleeping not sleeping all those things yeah dude i have never n done this shit in my entire life ever 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 the shit i've been like you're sleeping <clears throat> yeah like i've been depressed before <laughs> and uh like I've been through breakups before when I was younger and stuff like that too. And it's been like, I remember being young and being like, damn, like I was really young and immature mm -hmm. and uh, feeling shitty from it and just like kind of sleeping and doing, doing the like thing, the yeah. typical depressed thing. But this one is like, I don't know. It's like, uh, it's a real one. It's yeah. It's just it's a, a different. It, well, thing, actually what I think the know? difference is, is that before you probably like tricked yourself out of it too fast to where you weren't able to fully, like every experience yeah. and process the reason why you were feeling bad. Um, yeah, and, that's true. And, and, but this one you're kind of forced to because you're on your own. Yeah. You know, I'm excited to be on the other side of it. Like i still am definitely optimistic, but I'm just like, I'm tired. I'm very, very fucking tired. Yeah. I have never not slept before. And like regularly, <clears throat> about two times a week. I'm I'm not kidding because when people go like, I have insomnia. It's like, no, I don't have insomnia. I'm tired as fuck and I want to sleep every night, but I don't. Like, I don't even lay down to go to bed. Like, I procrastinate should I have to do and then I'm up for m a maximum of three days. And I go, to, That's like, just crazy. so bad, dude. I know, like, I know that. So I know bad. that. And it's not, it's not to be like, tell my friends that I haven't slept. It's like, bitch, I wish I was not doing this. Yeah. And it's like, uh, the bit my biggest thing is this this feeling of uh not having control like i don't feel like i have control of this situation at all and i like i've gotten my shit together for like a week and then i'm good and then fucking bomb and i'm fucking throw it all away and just like doing tons of just self-destructive shit mm -hmm. and yeah so i'm just trying but i'm i'm slowly slowly getting better it is going to be it's, it's so going to be a slow. very slow process so slow. and i think that and you know i think that like you psych yourself out because you think you're on the other end of it. Yeah. When when in reality, no, I'm better. You just had one day where where you were ah. able <laughs> you were able to do what you need to do and get to sleep all right. Yeah. And that's an everyday struggle, dude. I struggle with that, but not as extreme yeah. as you. Oh. Whoa. Yeah. No one can really compete with me, <gasps> and I think that you know, if I have something, no one else can have it. Yeah, that's pretty true. You know what I, I mean? feel like we kind of just uh, you know jumped really quickly into the trauma dump but which we had is to, good we, which is no, good get good. it out we had to get it out of the way so we're not like because we've also decided it, it, can i do you mind if i say it 
Do you mind if I say it? Say what? You mind, you mind if I say it? We've also decided that we're going to, unless there's shit we don't want to talk about, because there's always going to be shit like that, but just be a little bit more like how it, talk about things like that. Like we just talked about, we normally wouldn't talk about stuff like that. Yeah. And now like we if just we do bring something up, we're going to say like, I don't really want to talk about that. Yeah. But now it's not like in the, cause you know when shit like that would happen before you get this like wave of like ang- anxiety. And then it would be like, I can't believe they even fucking like thought that they could bring that up yeah. at all, you know, but <clears throat> I've, I'm letting go of that. I think we literally just kind of decided just before the podcast. We're like, yeah, like we should just be, how we would in person if we didn't want to talk about something like, I just don't really feel like talking about it. Yeah. 100%. I don't want these fucking losers fucking going <laughs> You've off. You've been really, stuff. really going after our, our listeners. Well, there's always man. been haters, man. There's always haters. Well, no, no, I'm not shit? talking Why about the great acknowledging people. acknowledging them? I don't know. Fuck them. Because I like them, man. I gotta like them. <laughs> Dude, you have a fucking uh, no, Stockholm love, Syndrome? I <laughs> no, I like them, No, man. I like them a lot. <laughs> <laughs> no, seriously. Um, But yeah, you know, I think it's just important to, to be to be real and and talk about things that um yeah. at the end of the day it's it's good it's cathartic it's healthy to talk about those things and to vent those things and why not do that with your best fucking friend and you know to hope that any <laughs> that anyone out there who's going through similar things knows that like True. you're not alone you know at the very least yeah. you know uh, dealing with like my mom being sick um is it's 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 just a weird thing. It's like very strange because it's one of those things that like on paper is such a big life-changing thing. Mm-hmm. Um and it's weird how life and time just continues to go. You mean just you how know? how like uh tomorrow keeps coming. Yeah. Yeah. Like nothing's going to stop that. Like there are times where um I'm down and I've, and I've gotten better at like kind of just accepting the reality of the situation and then mm. and choosing to like y- use use the time that I have with her left to like you know work on our relationship and and I'm yeah, grateful yeah, yeah. that without going into a whole story because it's not necessary just know that we have a complicated relationship um but it got to a point where I was like ready to just never talk to her again yeah you know mm-hmm. and as weird it, and unfortunate but also fortunate that it is is that this situation gave us a chance to you know work on our relationship and, that was and fucking beautiful it's, I've, it's I've crazy thought about that and i've talked about that like i've said man yeah that's like the such a beautiful thing it is and i'm know? grateful for that and it's like the <clears throat> the closure and the the catharsis that i needed from that you know what i mean like the healing that i needed from that because it's giving me the chance to like kind of i've already processed all those feelings right all those negative feelings like i've already processed all those to the point where i was ready to not talk to her anymore and so now that i've done that it's like i feel like i needed to do that in order to get to this point to where i'm ready to put all that aside and just like be with my mom again yeah and and be there for her as all this is going on and i'm going to see her next week um going to visit her and spend a week with her and just that's my sister nice. and I are going out there. Yeah, it'll be nice, you know. And it's it's like you know, just spending time and kind of making up for lost time and stuff. Like, mm-hmm. and it, and um, it, it going smoothly too. Like yeah. I remember when you first told me it, that like it's been good. Like, and you told me how it went. I was like, that's fucking amazing because yeah. like you never expect it to or think that even if it does happen one time that that's not just going to be gone the next time. And mm-hmm. it's been really cool. I'm really happy for you guys that you've been able to like maintain this like healthy relationship right now yeah you know, i'm i'm for very both of you guys. i'm very grateful for that and i know that she's um like just really happy yeah. about it you yeah, know yeah, yeah. um and yeah it's just one of those things man you know it's just one of those things it's heavy it's um heavy. but and i love you and i'll always be here for you i love you too man and i and likewise and me as well god there's so many things i know on this <laughs> unbelievable fucking table dude and i think that's actually in, in the bible verse uh catharsis one three mm-hmm. um there's so many things on this goddamn table how do we get around them Un- right and unto the and, and unto thee and then and then god opened the sky and dropped a piano <laughs> <laughs> on a scooby's head on a scooby's head on a scooby-doo's head yeah, no the different scooby <laughs> Scooby, yeah. My neighbor. yeah, dude, I was going Scooby diving. 
Cut to the end of the table shot. Cut to the end of the table shot. I mean, then we, we should cut to the end of the table shot. We should do it afterwards. We should get a, just a quick oh, shot. Oh, we'll never remember that. But, but, maybe, but maybe. 8.30. Wow. Guys. Wait, pause. <coughs> um, Guys, don't tell on us. Seriously, got to pause as well. So basically, you know, so we got some of that stuff out of the way. I got some of that. So, but basically, uh, we got some out of the way, you guys. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't realize you're doing the end until the last ten percent of that. Um, but now we can move on. We to got the that next out of segment. the way, and we'll talk about it when it comes up. But we're trying yeah. to, you know, look. I'll be honest. We don't want it to be a total. To, I wish that we, that we should have booked this for another hour. I, we can. We, we can send it. Beyond the Pine is sponsored by BetterHelp. It's tough to always know what's right or wrong for you, or to be recognized what you should be doing, and then how to actually do that. Like for me, sleep is probably the number one thing that I have to work on. I stay up so late every night, regardless of if I have to wake up early the next day or not. And for me, I think it's some rationalization because I'm so busy every day that this is me taking control and kind of getting my own time back. And that turns into staying up until two, three, maybe even past that in the morning, knowing that, and that's the thing with situations like this is like, you know, that it's not good for you, um, even with the rationale. And I know that, sure, maybe I'm getting my time back, but in reality, I'm just hurting myself in the long run. You know, you can't ever really make back that sleep. So for me, like, I know that I have to work on my sleep, get my sleep right. And a lot of other things are going to then kind of like piece together and start working out. And it's okay if you don't know how to fix all these problems. No one really does, but that's where therapy comes in. For me, therapy is a place that's a dedicated time where I can talk about my feelings, explore potential solutions to them, you know, kind of kickstart growth happening inside of myself. And even more than that, it's a place where you can be vulnerable and honest with yourself. Sure, you're talking to your therapist and you're probably going to benefit a lot from what you hear from them. But even on top of that, being able to be vulnerable with yourself and honest with yourself, I think is often overlooked. If you're curious about therapy and you're thinking about trying it, give BetterHelp a try. It's entirely online, designed to be convenient, flexible, and work within your schedule. Make your brain your friend with BetterHelp. Visit betterhelp.com slash pine to get 10% off your first month. That's betterhelp, H-E-L-P dot com slash pine for 10% off your first month. Thank you so much, BetterHelp, for sponsoring today's episode. And let's get back to the show. I don't know if I want to pay for it, man. Why don't you want to pay to be at my house, dude? It's you a great house. You want to know why I don't want to fucking pay to be at your house, why? dude? I'll tell you why. Why don't you want to pay to be at my house? I'll tell you why, because it's a fucking dump here. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, press at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that one wasn't good. <laughs> oh, that one <laughs> saved some for later. <laughs> oh, I left a little drewski in my Drewski in my underwear. <laughs> Drewski. <laughs> oh, the fucking YouTuber. I fucking love that Drewski. That left a little Drewski in the underwear. Bro. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dude, we laughing have to like do the that. Here every we time have now. to do it. Dude, <laughs> that gated my entire voice out. <laughs> dude, laughing like that is bringing back my cough from when I was sick last week. <laughs> dude, laughing like that is bringing back my cough from when I was sick. When dude, I was sick. laughing like that is bringing... <laughs> It's bringing back my cock. It's bringing back so many memories. <laughs> dude, Steve actually is live performing that. <laughs> dude, yeah, we actually have Steve on a fucking backside key over in the other taking room. Taking back shots, dude. <laughs> oh, taking by them, the not team. giving them. Oh, taking them. By the whole fucking football team, dude. Yeah, and we thought about that, but... Yeah, Steve's actually dating the quarterback. <laughs> You know, but he he's is, a cheerleader. He's going to experience the being the death of the bachelor, though. Yeah, no, for sure. What's going to happen is that the cheerleader is going to fucking kill him. Yeah, he, she is going to kill him. Yep. Now that so I think about anyways, it, anyways, um, I have a, I have a segment. Well, I no, just want to bring ahead. attention yeah, to the fact that it's so fun doing this. Yeah. But it's like because I think we should just extend another hour because we're like trying to rush and like get through all the things that we want to talk about that you're we've been right, holding in for right. eight months that we should just, did you turn my mic down? No. Oh, I thought you were like, cause you were like, dude, totally. Oh, I turned you up. Yeah, no, totally. What were you saying? Awesome. So ba <laughs> I can mute him. Cause I thought you were, you were sitting there like this. Uh huh. Oh, you, 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 I thought you were like, you admitted me. It might've just been ADHD. Cause yeah, I'm not I on think, my Adderall I think today. that you immediately like I've, actually tuned into that's what I was the saying. No, that's the first time that I didn't, I didn't hear what you said. I don't even actually remember what you said. Does my hair look good? 
Yes. yes That's does. two fucking goats glams up for James. You guys, welcome back to DJ Strindrup. Strindrup. Now you gotta go. Bad to be on the pie. <laughs> I love. Are we baking that in? Yeah. Yes, dude. dude. There's two stereo tracks, so there's no customizing this whatsoever, and it's fully processed. So you guys are getting it. It, lo- it does look. Well, there's it. A- What's wrong? It, well, it looks like it, we're hitting the maximum on this end over here, but it's it's. Give me a fucking toot and Let's hear that sounds. <laughs> no, I think we're good. And it's showing up. Yeah. No, I know that it's, it's definitely baking it in. I was more so talking okay, about good. it. Uh, I don't think it's baking. There's a really good limiter on here, but no, it's a really good limiter. You're going to hear what you're going to get guys. Remember that. Ah, it was a beautiful back. day on the pine grove trees forest where James looked at him like he wanted to suck it. James walked over to clay and he said, do you ever feel like a plastic bag? And what did I say to him? I says to him. <laughs> <laughs> and then they made love until the sun rose. Oh, I have a segment that I want to start. Yeah. Um, this is, this is for you guys, but only for James. And this oh. is a token of my <sighs> appreciation for your birthday. The day that you were born, the day that your mom and your dad fucked like mice. I don't want to talk about that for a little bit before we get into it. Not going to talk about that. You don't want to talk about that? No. You, that's too personal? <laughs> okay, I'll just imagine it. It's nice. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, I got James' birthday present and I had to order online. And if you're a Pokemon collector, you know what this is. If you're not a Pokemon collector... Hold it the right way up. You don't know what this is. This I'm so excited for that. Is a rare artist who did a collaboration with Pokemon and it's a Pokemon card card. It's one Pokemon card. <laughs> also, yeah. No, you I, Nagaba, ex Pokemon. So a little bit of a backstory here. In the last month, literally month, I've gotten so ridiculously into fucking Pokemon cards. Collecting yeah. them. Battling them, dude. Oh. Playing the actual fucking trading card game. Collecting them, dude. Battling them. Dude, and playing the actual trading too? game card game. Yeah, I'm the fucking Pokemon master. Yeah. I beat I be, be masters. Just use your splash. Yeah, <laughs> I, beat, I beat fucking... Tra- fucking chair. What just happened, man? <laughs> That's perfect. <laughs> you go, dude. Oh, yes. Birthday, I love you, dude. Okay, so guys, look. Here's what, here's what it is. And... You've just been manhandling this package, just putting it in your fucking pocket and shit. No, 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 not once. That was that has been that was in my Pelican case, and that was on a shelf. Wow, dude. Only. Okay, so it's very light. It's because it's one card. It stinks. Well, that's because I was rubbing it in between well, my ass. Because it's one card. Um, so this, it's what this is, at least I'm pretty sure, it, it's one of the evolutions. And for all you guys that it's are absolutely right, that are like into like sports or like girls and stuff like you're probably going to be like get on with it loser yep mm-hmm. big bummer but for everyone else out there the fucking cool smart fucking people that are going places yeah. you're like yo that's fucking tight dude keep going james just ignore and, it man. and i can't it's just such a good tune this is the new whales talk this guys. is not the new whales talk <laughs> this is so this is your pokemon background the, music the amazing thing so i believe that these are the evolutions one of the evolutions which is an evolution of eevee and i'm hoping very much so that it's an umbreon oh which is dark type it's one of my favorite pokemon probably umbreon. top five pokemon who knows if it's an umbreon let's get a little bit of asmr there oh get it really nice and close there actually too Okay, let's actually get a nice little fucking... Just and it's clue. Japanese. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, excuse me for that. Sorry, I was really excited. That one in. Unreal, dude. Nobody uses it like we use it, the farts. Find another podcast that does it as well. Don't look at it yet. I'm not. You always fucking do, though. Every time James opens the pack, I'm gonna, he's like, nope. oh, I saw it. I'm going like, to hold fuck, it up to man. you in the camera. Really? Yep. Okay. Upside down? I don't know what it is. 
Ooh, Glaceon. Not bad. That was the pit, dude. Ooh, Glaceon. Ooh, Glaceon. Uh, okay. okay, well, that's tight. I wish it was an Umbreon, but honestly, Glaceon is fucking sick. Wow, dude. That is such a dope card. You want to zoom in? Wow, what, no, what a good pull. I can zoom in. Yeah. Do you want me to zoom in? Just zoom in on it. Okay, I'm going to zoom in. Just on. zoom straight in on it. Take a picture of it and put it on top of the screen. I will. We'll do that. Cool. <laughs> they saw it. Wow. Because that'll be better anyways. They can take a moment. They can pause. They can look at it. They don't have to refocus. I'm going to take a really good picture, actually, of it. Yeah, I probably would, too. Um, and then you can do that. If you need more time, Studio 15 is available for another hour. Are they fucking watching us? Are they fucking watching us? Do we actually need it? What do you think, James? Perfect picture. Oh, put that on the screen. <laughs> <laughs> Do you think we need another hour? What time is it? Yes, I think so. It's 8.40. So. Yeah, for so sure. So we're 40 minutes over already. Just kidding. Well, that was just that was just Lucas because he wants to go to bed um, texting what? you about that because we're in his house because I remodeled the oh. his house into the studio. Hey, you guys need another hour. You can book it. <laughs> we'll take it. We'll just take it. Yeah, we should book another hour. For $28? Last minute, it's more expensive. Wait, add one hour? Sucking it and fucking it and booking it up. Um, and I'm, I'm, I'm going to pay it. Wait, it says add one hour to your session for seventeen fifty. Let's do it, dude. But honestly, at the same time, that's booster pack money, bro. That is fucking booster pack money. Dude, that's booster pack money. No, let's do it. Okay, let's do it. Yeah. I'm just also thinking about having to do work after this. Well, even if it'll at least give us another half an hour. Right. Agreed. You know, which is going to be good for the pot and then 30 minutes to tear down. You know what I think sometimes when I do things that I shouldn't have? Fuck it. Shouldn't it? Didn't it? Did it? Didn't it? Shit it? Come it? Wait, you fucking slut. Uh, take it away, James. Well, where's everybody coming from? It's the attack of the b big birds. They're coming from everywhere, man. What's going to stop them? It's the fucking army. Here comes the U.S. military, army, and navy. Star Wars! Star Wars! <laughs> um, Unreal. Dude. But, man, oh, dude, this is such a sick card, bro. Oh, should we do a should we do a booster pack opening for me every day? Yes. <laughs> Dude, every podcast I have to buy James Pokemon cards. Oh, I mean they're only like five bucks for a booster pack. Yeah, so you buy me when I buy you one. <gasps> yeah. Wait, look we at the buy other each other side of booster it. Pack look at the week. other side of it. Yeah, that's how Japanese cards look. Unreal, dude. I thought that Japanese cards looked different on the other side. They do. No, the other side. They do, but different than that. What's up? What's up? What's up? <laughs> should we do that booster pack? We buy each other a booster pack every week. One more chart and one more fee for the podcast. Whatever. Whatever. I don't fuck care. It. I, I have plans. It, dude. Yeah. I just I have plans. I, I can't just come. fucking paid my student loan and I filed my taxes today, baby. I'm in I'm in this paid red. I'm in the red. If you catch my drift. That means I'm broke. No, I'm game for that though, I think. I think I'm game for that. Or maybe once a once a week. Like once in a blue moon? Yeah, maybe just once a week. I check everyone. Five bucks. You know you already pay you already spend that on McDonald's. I do. I do. So? Podcast standard, one hour, cool, add guests. So we do that. We get a booster pack. Or if you guys want to buy us booster packs. <laughs> oh, do I knew we should have got the pod us? back together, man. Wait, guys, seriously, we're going to put a PayPal in the description. If you want us to do booster pack openings, we will do them. And you buy them. <laughs> <laughs> And you get a crown zenith and get a city of flames. Wait, is that lame or is that, who cares? It's $5. Do it. Send it for Pokemon cards. Who gives a shit? James is going to keep them. I'm going to open them and James is going to keep them. Deal? We're, we're going to split opening them. I'm going to keep them all. No, you're going to keep some of them too. Not some of them. If I'm opening split, I'm keeping split. Yes. Or I open them all and you keep them all. No. How about you open them all? I keep them all. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> we open what we keep. Keep it. Then we open it after. Yep. Okay. Yeah. Fine as it in it. In in it. Okay, so next on the topic list, guys, for coming back to the podcast, you know it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, next on the topic list, guys, for coming back to the podcast. <laughs> Hopefully none of this payment impose being showing up. Um we should be good. Bro. Okay, so little bit of a little bit of some more updates, some more live to update. So Right. We um oh. we just shot a short film. They didn't, they didn't even know. Yeah, we just shot a short film last week, you guys, and it it's gonna be fucking cool. It's very cool. So 
<clears throat> is it gonna be I'm going to give, great? here it is. James's story time. Play some music. Play the music. James's story time. <laughs> cool. So welcome back to James's story time, guys. Back in August of this year, my friends and I, yep, boom, boom, Lucas, Clay, Nick, and a bunch of other friends, we all developed a really, de- well, mostly us, Lu- Clay was just acting in it. <laughs> <sighs> And we developed a short film. It's It was like a psychological thriller, horror, nightmare kind of horror, experimental, trippy, fucking surreal horror. Don't do any more sound effects. Cool time. <laughs> Bummer for that. Um, we had the whole thing fucking planned, produced, 90% ready to shoot, week of, I get fucking COVID. Wait, James, what's that? Remember that fucking disease that was going around? That was the shut down the whole goddamn world, COVID, and then it just kind of disappeared? Yeah. It came and it fucked me, man. And so we had to cancel the shoot and we've pushed it indefinitely because then we got just so busy. Um, And I went to go visit my mom right after and just hadn't been able to do it. So that's one short film down that that we couldn't do because I got fucking sick. So then last two weeks ago, there was a 48 hour film festival, the Agbo No Sleep Till Film Fest. Agbo is the company that um, the Russo brothers made and they also produced... All right, we're They're in. the studio that's behind everything, everywhere, all at once, and several other films. And so big Sometimes established fucking company, like dope, time. dope fucking company. And so they have this yearly, I think it's the third annual film competition, No Sleep Till Film Fest, the 48 film hours, yeah. blah, blah, blah. Prompt was released at 5 p.m. on that Friday. You have until Sunday at 5 p.m., two days later, to write it, shoot it, edit it, fucking submit it. Yep. Me and Clay, Lucas was in fucking Europe on a fucking journey quest vision quest <coughs> he was he was and me and clay <laughs> <laughs> me and clay were like fuck it we'll do it us and so we got some of the other homies to come through and help yeah or we're gonna we're come gonna, through and help yeah and then so friday it's released it was a prompt about fucking time and usually i hate that dude yeah we were so pissed every i was so pissed dude i because everyone's gonna do a fucking groundhog day time loop or fucking time travel or parallel universes or multiverse Ooh, or, or the all click that fucking thing. shit uh, or the click thing and then or, doing or the fucking watch like all yeah. this fucking shit like that's it and i was like bummed that that was the prompt he was bummed and then me and clay came up with an incredible fucking idea and we won't tell you because you'll just see the short film when it gets released in a a few years can (laughs) i say something that i'm proud this is the most i've contributed to the to a film on the the conception side ever Mm -hmm. and that was so fun it was you and me we fully fucking well story story by us written by me yeah and um clay was gonna be the lead i was gonna was yeah, but we ended up recasting to fucking Riley Reed. And she kills it on my dick. Yeah. I loving that. I loving that. <laughs> I loving that. <laughs> and she killed herself on my dick. And, and I'm she loving that. <laughs> loving, I'm loving that. <laughs> Go Dude. ahead though. Anyways, so Clay's the lead. I directed. I, am, I, am. Um, I was gonna DP it, but long story short, so we were up, and you'll also see all this because we also shot um, an SB7 video, a new vlog. Yes, a we new did. Fucking just a couple friends video. Yes, we did. And it'll be coming out probably either right before at the exact same time or right after the short film comes out in the next month or so. Um, if we think it should, <laughs> I like it a lot. And it will. Yeah. Um. So we're up literally f- from five to fucking two in the morning writing. You, you're so ADHD. <laughs> 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 so you keep going, man. You're so ADHD. That's doing something. No, it couldn't. No, it's not. <laughs> Wait. I just heard a bling. Did this something happen to the computer? No. Nothing Everything's else? great. Awesome. <laughs> um <laughs> for uh, great, 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 great. Oh, good. Awesome. Awesome. Okay. No, continue, awesome. James. Seriously, we uh, want to hear what awesome. you have to say. Awesome. That's not a joke. Nice. Awesome. It's right there. Right there. It's fine. Yeah. Thank you. Barely. So from 5 p.m. until 2 a.m., we were up writing. <coughs> and the whole night or the whole day, I was like, fuck, man, I'm getting a little fucking tickle in my throat. And Lauren had been sick. She was just on the tail end of her sickness. And it wasn't a cock. Go ahead. It wasn't a cock. It was a cough. It wasn't a sore cock. And it wasn't a like, sucking cock. And I was like, 
Oh, fuck. I got a sore cock. Oh, fuck. I'm thinking I'm getting sick. Clay, can you suck it? I got strep cock. Yeah. Streptococcus. From throat cock. That's actually what it's called. Streptococcus. It is actually. Suck my caucus. Isn't it actually called streptococcus? Streptococcus. Yeah. Strip down and fuck my caucus. (laughs) (laughs) Um, (laughs) So then, guess what happened, guys? As if this story wasn't taken long enough. I woke up sick. Did you guess it? (laughs) I I woke up fucking sick. Two short films in a row. Dude. And I thought to myself, am I cursed? I I couldn't do another short film. Am I cursed? Like, is this really going to happen again? Am I cursed? Can I ever even do a fucking movie, make another movie again? Am I cursed? And I thought I was cursed. He wasn't, though. Because it turned out better than it could have been. Want to know why? why? Because Lucas comes back. Lucas. Boom. Boom. That's Lucas walking up to us. It's fucking noise getting itself. It's cutting itself. <laughs> <laughs> Lucas opens the door. I'm here. <laughs> <laughs> I wish you had more different sound effects. I, I want more. What's the catalog like? There's three banks and we've used them all. We've used every single one. We haven't used the crickets enough, so don't worry. That well, was that one's just okay. No, it's good. It's good for for making a boring moment out of something that wasn't boring, and then that's laughing. <laughs> so we shot. <laughs> See, that's the perfect timing. It wasn't going to be fucking boring. <laughs> so we thought, fuck it. A week passed. Lucas came back, and we shot it last weekend, and we completed it. We shot a fucking short film, baby. Yeah, we fucking did, dude. And it was so fun. And I had been taking a Meisner class, actually, for a Go month ahead and hit the crickets. prior to this. And I've been taking a fucking Meisner class, dude. An absolute legendary Meisner class. And I've been crafting my style one Pokemon at a time. <laughs> 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 You're like, you're fully like, you're fully gone, bro. Oh, um, I've been taking a Meister class and like really. Sorry, I'm going to play Pokemon jumping TCG in. Live. Come on, man. That's actually disrespectful. I'm listening. <laughs> Magical right after. <laughs> Sad thing. So I'd been taking a Meisner class because I was just like, I might as well do this. I might as well actually, like, I'm here again. I had not been in LA for like two years and I couldn't have acted while I was there if I wanted to. And I was like, I'm not going to like take for granted being here. Uh, it was really good for me. And then I didn't continue because it still costs like $300 a month to do. And I was like, I, I, I can't do it right now. I try not. Do yeah. It. And then if something will pick up. When you can. I just need to be Don't more responsible with my money, though. I'm just really... Well, that's everyone, dude. Bad at spending it on different things. I spent probably... I bought a bunch of gear. I bought like I probably bought like $500 worth of Pokemon card in the last month. Yeah, and that's actually true for some <laughs> reason. But I did, um, I did really love doing it, and it was greatly beneficial. I wish I could have finished doing it for two years first before I quit, but... Um, You'll come back. I absolutely will. I'm going to do a different school anyways. I, that's what I was doing. I was trying to switch. He's going to do school. some driving school. He's got to pick up... I don't know where to He's fucking turn. Legally has I just to. don't know where to fucking turn. It's a do. legal thing. You legally are required to take driving okay, school. So traffic it's school. a legal thing. What's that going to stop me? What? That means I can't enjoy it? Stopped me once. I stopped twice. Stopped Shh. me once. I stopped at the light. It was gray. Stopped me once. I stopped at the light. And I don't care about it. Oh, bro, you know what I just fucking realized? You, don't, you have any couple bucks on you, cash? No, dude, I don't have a fucking couple bucks cash on me, man. Why? What do you Cause need? Because you're right, that fucking vending machine is cash only. What I fucking say, Well, dude. it's because the credit card thing is, like, <clears throat> out of service. Isn't it? But it was on there. <laughs> and you know what's funny? They're not going to service it. No. They're it's not been that way for fucking. eight fucking years, man. Eight years blind. 11 ounces. Eight years, 11 ounces. Eight years, 11 ounces blind. Pregnant, fucked in the head, and this bitch is horny and fucking racist. Literally racist, and it's kind of something that you don't. But she's realize. hot. But, but she's, she's hot. hot but she's hot. <laughs> That's my new laugh, dude. <laughs> don't. No, I don't want it. What? No, I don't want it. All right. No, nah, I don't want it. What's yeah. this? That's my new. Fuck go- yeah, that's what I thought. So you don't think I should laugh like that? It's not, it doesn't compliment no. me and my vibe. No, it honestly <laughs> makes you so 
fucking what? punchable, dude. You know, I think it sounds like a cool laugh. Like if Zach. Uh, <laughs> falls asleep. Dude, Zach from fucking. Uh, oh, I hit a button. <laughs> cool. Yeah. Anyways, that's the bit. So what are you guys wearing? <laughs> and that everybody who's watching that is the moment that his brain stops and reboots. <laughs> I love that so much. We have to always get this room so we know that we have that. So guys, um, I asked you to send in some messages, some audio and video messages, and you did. And I asked you not God to talk to me it. again, and, and you I, did. Yep. Some of yep. you didn't. He, I, Some look, of you did. don't worry about. I know he's being a little aggressive towards you guys, a little hostile towards you guys. But it, I just want you to know that it's because he's not having the best time himself in life. He's going through hard times That's himself not it. in life. That's not it. That's not. So he's taking it out. I'm not. He, he's, don't do what you're doing because it's making it's affecting me. This is an effect. Just stop fiddling with shit, man. This fucking stop windscreen. fucking touching everything. <laughs> Dude, this windscreen's not fucking up your head. No, it's headphones. touching fucking wires. I just heard it crackle. Where? Your fucking plugs in the air. It's all intertwined. This is police shit. <laughs> well done. <laughs> Thank you, bro. <laughs> Dude, I, I just. I want to get a pizza so bad. I'm a so pizza? fucking hungry. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, yeah. Yeah. I want a pizza, man. And I'll get it, and I'll get it, get it with gold cheese. cheese. And I'll get it with a cup, please. <laughs> and a and little bit of tits. A... And just a little bit of tits. Oh, do you have a Coke with that? Can I diet? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> so, Anyways, so wait, who is wait, gonna buy a bowl? Did you see? <laughs> <laughs> you know that just reminded me of. <laughs> yeah, I just remember. That's a good one, man. That's a good one. Yeah, dude. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, okay. It always gets me mad to get lightheaded. <laughs> <laughs> Man, this is making me lightheaded and epic. And I'm hoping you guys are liking the new podcast set. Yeah, we had it built. We renovated Lucas's apartment, and this is now our podcast set forever. I think I just every left week. My house on fire. I think I just left my house on fire. <laughs> oh, shit. So every week, this is going to be the podcast set. Yep. Unless that's not. Yeah, unless like we watch it and we're like, this sucks. The vibes not. The vibes not off. Well, I'm gonna do a lot of fucking AI shit to it. Yeah. Wait a minute. I just actually realized that Should there, we do generative fill? There so is a super there, tiny. Uh, no, there, and then we're in front of like the Taj Mahal. There is a really good generative fill. I know there is. I'm we, not going to do it. It's one click thing. I'm not going to do it. Why is that? I'm anti AI. I hate that about you, you fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Let's tune into our. So boring and dumb. Give me a transition to the callers. Caller time. <laughs> Yucky. Our first, <laughs> excuse me. So our first caller here, um, we're going to take one headphone off so that we can listen to it. Transitional caller number one. You're on the fucking air. The dope thing too is the gate on here mm -hmm. is going to not pick this up. It's its own channel. What? It's plugged into here. Remember? I thought you plugged it in. That's why we got the you cord. You dumbass. I told you there when you tried it. No, you didn't. Oh, we didn't try it. We did it. get the cord. Let's figure it out. Yeah, you just plug it in and then play it. And did you plug that in? No. You plugged it in here. You're supposed to plug it into the headphone. No, that's a thing. That's a different thing. Oh, oh, oh. There. Give me it. It's right there. It doesn't go into there. That's for that's going out. It does have to go into here. Okay, we'll grab it. Grabbing it. Oh, we, we do need fucking jack. Oh, we might. Um, We'll pull one off the other one of the mics. Oh, yeah, dude. We're killing this, dude. I don't know what... <laughs> or there's oh. one, two, three, four. Are they like tied in or yeah. are they fixed? Fixed. Um, let's think about this. You'll play, you'll put it in afterwards, and we won't, you'll like we normally do. I know, but it, one, is there two, no three, other, click. there's no, no. Oh, 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 take one from there. Yes. So let's stand up and do this together. Here. Oh, it was literally has a fucking iPad yes, picture on dude. it. Dude, yes. Oh, fuck, fuck yeah. yeah. Wait, oh, oh fuck, fuck yeah. Oh, oh, fuck yeah. Oh. Oh, pass, it, pass him here. Oh, pass him pass here. <laughs> no. Okay. Oh, yeah, Bad fucking number. pass him here. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Dude, the disrespect. 
What? That's our little cum slut, dude. Ah, that is our little cum slut, dude. He would fucking do anything for us, man. And I he still has. think, I still think we should fucking have that thing sawed into thirds so we can all have a piece no. with us. It's, I think that's it's special. Mine for the next three years. Well, you've had it for a year. So two mm, more years. Whatever. Two more years. Yeah. And then I won't then be friends with Steve. with Steve again. Really? No, yeah, I will. No, you won't. No, you <laughs> all right, didn't. let's see if this works. Okay, uh, guys, what one is that in, huh? Say something I don't know. Can you hear it? Nope. Are you playing something? Oh. From oh, oh, MG, dude. My God. All right. Guys. So bump that so. shit. I'm going to start it over. Welcome, caller. Uh, caller number one. Hello, Chib and James. My name is Aiden, and I just graduated from a school in Georgia. A college school <laughs> kind of school. And so, uh, yeah, I just wanted to send you guys this message yeah. and tell you that I've been commenting on all of James's TikToks and some of his Instagram posts. Uh, if you guys don't make another Brooklyn Boys video, that's you. Up, that's uh, you. I'm probably piss and shit and come and cry. Okay. Um, so you guys should uh, yeah. do that for sure. Oh God, I gotta go take my birth control. Wait. <laughs> oh, that was great, dude. That was really good. Great ending, dude. Perfect. That bit. You nailed really that shit, dude. Really good, dude. You nailed really, that shit, really bro. Good, dude. That was a really good end of that bit. Great punchline. You wrote that, huh? Absolutely um, bomb worthy. Well, you know, let's stop the bomb on him. I like it. Um, Brooklyn Three. If it yeah. happens, it happens. No, I think it, it definitely could. We would just have to be well, a we place did where technically we're make silly. that third Brooklyn Wait, movie. If you haven't seen that it's movie, <laughs> we did make that first Brooklyn movie. Um, we did make a third Brooklyn Boys. It was like Brooklyn Boys, it was a, like a the pilot of a series we were gonna start, and then we immediately just didn't do it. Yeah, because that was right after like SP Seven ended. It and just means it wasn't right. It wasn't right exactly. If, if you are excited about something and you're like, oh, we're gonna do this, this, I'd this, be this, interested in watching that. Yeah, I'd be interested in watching that. <laughs> you could, you could play it on there and then match it up, because you just have to match the video up. Yeah, and just don't pause it. I could, or let's don't. Yeah, because. I don't remember. You already have three cameras to, to play with. That's okay. I mean, I'm literally just going to split screen ours and just fuck. And you know what? It's a whole Leto. level. Leto. Jared Leto. But should we just do that now then? If you want to, yeah. What do you think? It's like, it's, it's kind of long, isn't it? No, it's not. It's well, like let's four, see. four minutes. I'll just look it up. Is four it on your channel? Yeah. yeah. Kib. God, it's good to be back, man. It's good to be back. You know, we always... You know, the funny thing is, too, guys, we actually used to do this podcast. Uh, every episode that you've seen where we're on Discord, we're actually here using generative AI to put us back in our yep. respective domiciles. Yep. So beep, 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 beep. Just, ima just imagine that. It's only five minutes. It's only 45 minutes. Let's get it. Going to watch it together. Um, huh? Can you move the... L here, wait, before you do that. What am I doing before... Before doing, what am I doing? Ooh, it's gotten a little chilly in here, hasn't oh, it's it? too short, huh? Yeah, oh, oh so I'd be careful much. with pulling it. Um, Let's just put it anywhere. Is this still recording and everything? Yep. Okay. Because <sighs> it'll be on the screen. It's literally just for us to see it. That's going to be awesome. This is not a water bottle. It's an air up bottle. It's an asshole. <laughs> this, is, this is not an advertisement that we want on the podcast. Is that separate? Well, we'll just do the uh, ad live, by the way. Yeah. Which we should have already done. Uh-huh. I think I'm a mom. She's not with? really my cousin, man. She's not really my cousin, okay? She's your cousin. Do you want me to explain really what it is to you, Ronnie, really? Ronnie, really? My sister, half-sister, removed. Ronnie. Ronnie. Is that my phone? No. Is that my phone? I don't hear anything. Where's my phone? She's your sister? Half sister. <laughs> I gotta, I gotta like really mold this over, man. It's I love my fucking time. Oh shit, I'm late. Okay. Where we gotta go? We gotta go. All right. My shirt was already on. <laughs> gotta change. I gotta go. Where are we going? How you doing, ma? Hey, ma. I mean, how you doing? Don't look at me, boyfriend. Hey, bitch, 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 tits. <laughs> you open up the ass, too, don't you? I open the ass. What I do is I grab Hey, you shove your face in. <laughs> hey, man. I'm loving Dude. It. I open the ass. What I do is I grab one cheek, left cheek, right. I'm not a fan. <laughs> <laughs> I love fucking doing ADR. You know that, 
Absolutely. Oh, Ronnie, I'm talking about money, Ronnie. I don't have any money on me. I can get money and then make a few calls. Can I borrow your phone? Jesus, somebody, hey, 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 oh, hey, 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 hey. Well, I'm sitting Relax. here. So what are you going to do? This is a two-time team. Okay, for sure, Ronnie. But the main thing is, is I'm living with my cousin. You're kind of staying with me, so you got to be the one paying the... Does you're living sense, with the cousin Ronnie? you're in love with? He's just not that <laughs> smart, but you got to make some serious cash, man, if you want to keep if you want to keep living with me, you know what I'm saying? Bro, I had this fucking wet dream last night. <laughs> <laughs> Right, ass it. No ass. Open to Mars. She was trying to walk backwards to me, spread ass, eagle, no ass. Like the whole hey, what's going on, brother? What's up, brother? Uh, so, what's up, brother? Uh, sorry, I got to me off that. <laughs> fucking, that, guy's a, that guy's a fucking prick, man. That guy's a fucking how real asshole. Hey, how you doing? Listen, I, I'm going to tell you something. Dude, I love okay? these guys. Like, when I just I'm imagine them being real guys, people. I'm like, I fucking I'm love these guys. Grades, my best Dude, friend. Frankie Fee? Frank, Frankie Fee was second. Remember Frankie Fee? Yeah, oh, he's all oh, money. Uh, yeah, the guy who had the money on the eyes. No, no, he didn't have money on his eyes. He he started a letterhead business. Oh, wait, you're talking about the guy you used <laughs> he to started a letterhead business. Now? No, 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 the guy that was used to bullying. Like he was bullying. But no, he was bullying you. It, it was but bullying. that's why they called him Bully Bill. Pretty Fee. Yeah. He used to walk around Freddy. these silly ones newspapers Freddy. and make paper mache hats out of it. He'd walk around these hats, everybody said, get, get out, out of here. Yeah. yeah, he bullied me hard, right? The next thing I do, you have my word, the next thing I do. He bullied right, me hard, right? It's going to be about money. You watch. Swear to God. The next thing I do is gonna be about money. <laughs> and that's what the movie's about. But <laughs> instantly play oh, basketball. Well, kind of <laughs> this is the end of our day. No, what are you trying to spar me right now? I'm not trying to spar on me. Whoa, whoa, wait, Come on, Get a shot of that. Almost knocked him over. Get a shot of that, cameraman. Get a shot of that. Get off me. This is not basketball. I'm not doing nothing, man. I'm checking out my limbs. I don't want to bust a string. Watch this free throw. You ready for this? Bonk. The wind Bonk. I was on a summer league in high school. It's fucking nuts, but I was playing fucking. Switch to a Boston accent. Week, I was in fucking Boston, summer, summer league. league. Yeah, summer league. Fucking summer league, and you were never in summer league. You were too afraid to in try out. In high school, man, you were too afraid to try out. For four fucking freshman year. Don't pretend you weren't too afraid to try out, Ryan. I wasn't too afraid. I got into oxy. <laughs> I got into oxy, <laughs> I got into oxy <laughs> before freshman shot. year. <laughs> Classic. <laughs> I mean, Ryan's kind of a sore loser. It's not a big deal because he get he can get heated and then things can Is that turn like into a. Now, man? What? He's never gonna be able to cap, cap up the cosh because um he's not even talked to my uncle yet. I'm trying to get him to talk to my uncle so that we can do uh do some jobs. Right. But if I make the shot, you double owe, or nothing. Yeah, you owe me 20k. If I lose, it's 20k I owe you. Yeah, <laughs> Ronnie. Nobody knows how much money Ryan's gonna owe me by the end of the day. You crossed the line, man. Yeah, you crossed this line. You did cross you the line, man. I, I, I did. You did fucking. Cross he did. He did cross the line. You did. He did. Yeah, you crossed it. Oh, he's running bare feet on the pavement, man. Nice, nice. These nets are higher than they were earlier. The heat, the heat. You know, how is it? I hope the level of this they, isn't too loud. But they start creaking in the night when they to get not hear us nets. talk. No, we're like way over it. Nice. Yeah. In, the, in the heat of the day. You know That's awesome. We hope. What? This is perfect. It's sunk. I hope. <laughs> Look, we took a first day to get acclimated. Tomorrow we'll pick it right yeah. back up. I made that promise to you. I do not go back on my promises. You do not go back <laughs> on your promises, hopefully. My uncle's gonna call. Let's just do God. some work, all right? I loved making right. those goddamn right. videos, Ronnie. Yeah, amen, brother. Love making those um, videos, dude. <laughs> Woo! Hello, Chib and James. Oh. Done with that. Is this another guy? We do have another call, actually. Ooh, um, another right. call from Aiden, believe it or not. Aiden! You get a second chance and then never a third. You in here, bud? Also, I've recently found myself, um, anytime I trip up on my words, I go, you ever wrap a fish around your cock and see if gun come get you? Uh, uh, that's uh, by far the funniest bit that I've ever seen. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, dude. Wait, did you say that? I don't. That sounds like something that we say just regularly. Um, like a million different what was variations. It again? Yeah, I don't think it was specific. I think it was wait, just wait, wait, a, wait. was the. A sh you have a rap here. I've recently found myself. Um, anytime I trip up on my words, I go, "You ever wrap a fish around your cock and see if gun come get you?" Uh, that sounds uh, like something uh, you've uh, said. It does sound like something I would say. Yeah, you wrap your head around your and see if it's gonna come get ya. That sounds like something you've said. But it also sounds like something that you could you could would say. No. Certainly that's, that's a kid only line. you or that's me. That's a kid line, dude. No, because you would do it like 
Did you ever wrap your head around your cockhead and see if it's going to come get ya? No. That's a kid blind. It has to be. Shit. Or that's just something that he started saying From in the, the style of Kib. Hmm. But he also said that's well, one of the funniest kids. That didn't really ha- hit it as hard. There it is. Let's ask Kim what he thinks. What style was that in? Just as because uh, my guess I think is that it was a line, or SB7 it was something that yeah, or something that he came up with oh. and was really looking forward to sharing it with us. Yeah, and he was because he left a separate think, message. Feel free to use it if you want. We'll do. So, cuts <laughs> out. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, bringing us into our next video. Absolutely. Guys, do you have another caller? We do. We have another caller. All right, guys. This next caller is fucked in. in the head and totally Good, dumb. In. And this caller's eating dog shit off the ground every year yep. since they were born. It's yep. a tradition at this point. I don't know how many he's eating. I don't know how many he's going to eat. But he's here with us today. And it is. Who is it? Hey, Kib. Hey, James. Hope you boys are doing well. <laughs> uh, just got one question for you guys. We'll today. ask it. Uh, I really love, well, first off, I watch back over the Sugar Pine 7 videos religiously Shit, far yeah. too much. Thanks, man. Dude, I love Sugar Pine 7 videos. Sugar bi- Time. <laughs> I love Sugar Pine 7 videos. Thank you, dude. For regular Seriously. human consumption. But uh, my favorite overall bit that you guys did is the one where Kib gets put into that giant cardboard box pinata that Mimi makes. <laughs> I forgot about that. Bro, and I just rewatched that Bruce the other day. Bruce Green's office. Yeah. And Kib reaches out with the microphone and <laughs> and drops it on the floor. So good. That yeah, bit literally cracks fucking... me up every time. Um, I love it. Ah, ah, it's ah, hilarious. Ah. Um, <laughs> just a question <laughs> as to how that came about. What was the inspiration? <laughs> was there a funny I'll idea you, or was it just kind of some random thought. Uh, that's pretty much it. Just want to say, love, love what you guys do. Thank you. All dude. the cool <laughs> shit and music. Um, you, keep bro. at it. Love you guys. Love you too, bro. Love you, brother. Thank you so Seriously, much, man. man. Um, it's really funny. <laughs> Quiet down back there, bitch. Seriously, you goats. fucking bitch. That's it's really right. funny. I. It's like when people ask us, "Oh, where'd the inspiration for this bit come from?" Being silly, and I want to be like, and I want to be like. Something that popped into our head three seconds before we did it. Yeah. And a, ma- and a maximum of five minutes if we're about to shoot a video or, you know, the same concept, but the day or before. Or in the moment as we're recording it. Yeah. Uh, most of our shit, it was literally improv. It was like, literally improv. <clears throat> the idea of like, what is the episode going to be sometimes contains... Uh, an in the moment beats that to same hit thing shit, yeah. of like oh and wouldn't it be so funny if you did this it's literally just like we know our style of comedy um, not by a formula but b- instinctually that's how we function even now even the pa- since we haven't been doing the podcast we're still just as silly boys doing but the wait same a minute. shit Mimi had made that for that video so we so we had we the idea of, is we of, were gonna like put me in a pinata or oh, maybe not even Ace that. Ventura what do you mean? Ace Ventura, When Nature Calls. Oh, when he's in, when the, he's in the Rhino. Yeah, that's what inspired us. I think that you and me you watched sure? that movie like recently. I have no memory of that. I'm just trying to remember because I know that that's, that was the main inspiration of that bit. You're sure it's the main inspiration and not like, oh, that reminds us of that now? Because that's what I was going to say that like it reminds me of no, that. I think, no, I actually just watched the video a couple days ago randomly. Yeah. And um, I, I even like refer to it. Oh, I refer to that scene. So those of you that don't know what we're talking about, there's a video where I'm a, in a pinata and uh, it's called sexy pinata. It's, it's got like almost pinata. a million views. Really? <laughs> yeah. Oh, thank God. That, I love that video. Cause it's sexy in the title. Yeah. <clears throat> and there's no sexy in it, but <laughs> I, I see now it, it, see, that's the thing. Like, I don't remember um, using that as inspiration, but I look back at it now and I'm like, well, oh, that's that so point, like we had, I love Jim Carrey. We had like, planned out our videos more and had yeah. like, yeah, like, like we said, Beats. like no, the I know general that, yeah. fucking outline of it. So like the idea of us getting in trouble and Bruce talking to one of the people from Rooster Teeth and, spying, and us right. spying on him, I think came from like, that was the probably the original like idea right, that right, the rest right, of the right. video then happened around you know i bet you it started off as like let's do a trojan horse thing where someone goes inside something and then someone said like oh like jim carrey yeah, the yeah, fucking yeah. hippo yeah yeah yeah, yeah. 
that that I could see that's how that probably because then happened. I was like that definitely wasn't full um, improv because yeah. Mimi had fucking made that no you and you can't yeah. improv getting in a pinata setting up camera angles and doing yeah, the thing can. the only thing that was improv was that I turned my hand into a character so good I, and I the fact that you pop the I, mic out and it's n it's just a mic there's no wire yeah with that in particular I I just knew as soon as it was going out that like it would be so funny seeing this big ass microphone coming out of the thing yeah. like it's not like this tiny little secret mm -hmm. it's like <laughs> and it's funny that literally that like like kib, one of these microphones it was literally and it's funny that kib would think that that's secretive enough mm -hmm. and this big ass thing goes out and then it's so big that it was like you had to you had to humanizing like humanizing in the first place you had to like break the hole in order to fit your hand through <laughs> and then and then, and then you drop it go out. and then you drop it and you were like and then my hands, and you go, yeah and then you're like <laughs> and then there's the pause That's and then you're in bro you breathe through you try to grab all it. i knew is my hand yeah. is me is now. visible yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I knew no, that 100%. it was why it was mm -hmm. like you don't think about it but like you know what you're doing yep. no and, and honestly you that's think the it's genius as funny of that as, performance. as what you know as those of you that think that's funny, I thought it was that funny when I was doing it, mm -hmm. you know, and you hope it's funny. And you hope it translates. Sitting there filming it, I was probably laughing so hard. Dude, dude. you're shaking. Uh, that's, I love doing physical shit like oh, yeah, that so 100%. much. Because when you do something unexpected that's so fucking ridiculous and somehow makes sense that the person would do it that way in whatever you're doing, yeah, it's such a nice, like, because it's like ran just random's not funny to me. Yeah. Like no. I hate just regular fucking. You have to perform like, within the so parameters random. of the way that the character. You have to perform in character. You have to do. Yes. What, yeah. What, what the motivation of what that character would be motivated by. Exactly. That's exactly fucking what it is. That's exactly what and, it is. And you did that with Kib, dude. And like. Because then it's not in random. A way, you did that in a you way know? that I've seen. I've like obviously in. I mean in person. Personally experienced. Mm. And how that translated on camera. Like. Better than anyone I know. You're so sweet. I love you. Where yeah. is the gold hidden in the room? Did anyone see? Because uh, I certainly didn't. But did we? I've got another, another we caller. Really? We have oh three more. We have three more fucking guys, callers, let's, guys. Let's give the the new caller just as welcome of a warming coming right in. <laughs> we have our so next caller. Bump it, bump it. Yep, and. What's Turn up? him up. James and Clib. Yeah, that's all the way up. Crib. Clib. Clit. 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 Ew, 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 ew. Stop saying Clit. Um, <laughs> great to have you guys back. Thanks, man. Ew, ew, ew. Stop saying Kib. Um, <laughs> ew. It's me. Kib, 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 Something Sounds I like look forward to in the car. You guys, you guys just Came vanished. Tired. What happened? I don't know. Did we just vanish or did um, we say something? We just vanished. Oh, that's fucked up. So we'll, we'll speak on that too because we haven't spoken on that yet. Yeah. So what happened was we um, we got to that point where we... Like missed a week. We missed we'll a week. Do next week. And oh, then we'll do it next week. We were like, three weeks. yes, pretty much. And then we're like... And, and, and we got to make an announcement. The build up that had happened was like, I mean, for the two years... Dude, Plus, it was every week for was, two years we're like that of just us doing it, not even counting yeah. the year and a half fucking two years before that. But it was like two years of you and me doing it, just us. Yeah. And that whole time we maybe missed a week. Right. Like we had literally done so many. And then like towards the end there, the last like month or two, like we missed like a week here and then did like three and then missed a week and then like did two and then missed a week. And then got to the last one where we had missed a week, missed another week. Miss another week, yeah, and then seriously, and we were, were like, really busy at that time. Nobody was depressed yet. We were no, just fucking we were busy. Depressed. I was depressed. Really? Mm -hmm. That long ago? Were Were you depressed about the same things? Mm -hmm. I didn't know it was that. I thought it was more recent. Than that see, like the, the last like L A for me is a blip in time, a fucking blip, and I'm still in the middle of it. But it's a, it's like a blip. I literally couldn't even tell you how long I've been here. I don't. I think know. you've been here like four months. That's hey, you moved here in June. Insane. You moved here in June. July, August, September, October. That's insane, dude. Yeah. I have done nothing but time flies when you're fucking sluts. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, and then 
we so so much time had passed like we we passed the threshold of like a gracious ending yeah yeah, like yeah, 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 a, yeah, yeah. a graceful <laughs> ending of being like yeah they really on the know, show being like guys we're going to next week's going to be our 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 last episode for a while no we just like disappeared and then tweeted about it guys <laughs> See you later. Dude, nothing We're fucking out of here. <laughs> um, yeah. And then tweeted about it. And then obviously since then, so many of you have been like, when are you guys coming back? When are you guys coming back? As if we care. <laughs> yeah, as if we fucking thought we were going to come back. <laughs> as if we didn't decide that just last week. We actually, I mean, I think inside, like I was always like, yeah, we're definitely going to start someday. No, I don't know sure. when. For sure. We but definitely know. will come back. Like there's no way. This is going to be one of those things that we, we do, do on and off forever. Well, we don't know if it'll be off again. <laughs> if I'm on set shooting my feature, it'll be off. No, it won't because we'll on. pre-shoot them. Like or every, we do it on set. Like, <gasps> dude. Or we do it on set. Well, yeah, because it'd yep. be so sick. Yeah. And do people most But then podcasts, we can't put it out because of an NDA. Dude, most podcasts are pre-recorded. Like Bobby Altov and all these big podcasts, they shoot like six to seven of them uh, in like yeah, a week. Yeah, but they're talking to Drake and he's so hot. Yeah, but- we're not talking we to, Drake, talk to Drake no matter what. Are you kidding? You're talking to Drake? I'll be dead. Can I get it on my podcast? But we will. Wait. No, no. I thought like the camera cut or something. Dude, there's so many moves in the camera. It's slowly being pulled away. Let's finish this guy's message. I was going to say something, man. I was going to say. But this is the first podcast we've done in person where it's not just a one time random off kids yeah, this coming is to like LA the new play. Name. You don't even call me kid, but you guys do. And that's fine, I guess. But this is forever in person again. Because I'll <gasps> never leave James's side. Yep. Not again. And not again. And not again. Go ahead, James. You know, let's let's catch up though. I mean, what have I been doing? Jesus, that sounded like me. Um I actually you know, let's let's catch you know, up though. Hey James, uh, it's, you know, a little more relevant to you here, but uh, I got a job in film, in video production, and video editing. Fuck, I can't fuck yeah, dude! <laughs> Sorry, was oh, whoa, whoa, shut up! Yeah, that's just you know, me. a little more relevant to you here, but uh, I got a job in film, in video production, and video editing. Fuck yeah! I can't say where. I've got an NDA. It's big boy. Browsers. <laughs> but uh Mia Khalifa. Uh, Mia Khalifa. Uh, it's really inspiring to see your work, man. I think. Thank I, you, bro. So I true. can confidently say that, you know, SP7 and your work beyond that has, has inspired me to pursue my uh, career in film. So I appreciate thank, that, thank man. I'm glad. That. And so I think good. the stuff you're doing is incredible. Uh, Kib, before I uh, touch on your your uh, your artist's work, there's a story I know that you don't want me to bring up. This is when you and I actually met in Salt Lake City. I can't forget that. At the Rex show. You why don't want me to bring I, this up. Why wouldn't I want you to threw me that? to the ground. You uh, started just... Stop. Stop beating it. me up stop beating, beating me up recording. beating me up i mean and you know saying these words that i just i just can't even repeat here and now but don't because i'll um, mute him besides from that besides that interaction man, I, I think wells talk is just incredible it's not and this applies to you too uh james thank I you don't think you guys aren't just like youtubers turned filmmaker or artist no you guys we're not putting real passion into your thank work thank you bro I really st- that is high praise, and thank you for recognizing that because that but is But beyond true. passion, it's the, the product we're making is beyond YouTubers' material as well. And what we're making is beyond the pine. Do that. And, you know, I got, I got plenty of whales talk in my playlist. And I thank don't you, put dude. anything in my playlist. I put quality stuff in there. You, you got whales talk, Mark. PewDiePie, Markiplier. Oh. <laughs> Jake. I got fucking Jake and Mickey, Mickey, Jakey. I got fucking all the YouTubers in I that bitch. I got fucking Gus Johnson. <laughs> <laughs> I a lot of all of his videos. <laughs> so it's That's just because I don't say his name. No, no. It sounded like a scream. More, more, more. Wrong one. No, it's the last one. <laughs> all right, all right, all right, play. Any? Uh, no. Hey, Fuck, that's funny. It's great to have you guys back. Thank you, man. Uh, this is your boy, Jared. We're super close. Pause. If you guys don't remember, we just. 
Jared, you don't know if it's nice to have us back yet. You didn't watch the episode yet. Once you watch the episode, let us know if it's nice to have us back. I would like to know if it's nice to have us back, but don't just say it's nice to have us back if it's not nice to have us back. We want to know if it's nice to have us back. Either way, we're going to keep doing the podcast if you're watching or not. Maybe you forgot, but yeah, it's good to talk to you guys. Uh, Be in touch soon, you know me. That's unreal, dude. That's unreal. Dude. <laughs> dude. <laughs> I wish I could make it go for stereo. <laughs> Love you, dude. <laughs> so good. All right, now we have two more videos. Okay, okay. You turned oh, me down. Really? I can't hear myself. You you hit mute, dumbass. Where? Bottom right. Yep. Yep, there it is. Really? Yeah. Huh. I think that's... <laughs> <laughs> Unbelievable. I hope that's funny for them. I have no idea. I don't, I don't care. care if it isn't. <laughs> no. um, all right, so we've got two more videos. <sighs> oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. This kid. Uh... Can you turn your name on? What's going on, fellas? Welcome back. Um, I can't wait to listen oh, to I the episode. It's like, welcome back to my show. Um, Love but I just have a quick story about a time that I ripped off uh, one of your bits for my own <laughs> personal benefit. And um, <laughs> basically, uh, a year ago, I had given my two weeks notice of my job. And I was still booked for a conference on my second to last day with my boss. And uh-huh. my boss. Um, yeah. And it's like my second to last day. So I'm like, fuck it. Like, I'm just going to paint my nails ah, fuck I like it. to paint my nails on the weekends but fuck like I yeah. never really did at the office or whatever but it was like my last day so whatever so I go to the conference it's like this big you know big conference fancy hotel in New York and um so on the train right in I'm like oh my gosh they're definitely gonna get say there. something they're definitely gonna like, on, comment get on there. my nails and stuff fucking like that. get so, like, there man what's my response gonna be so I come up with like something devious like the perfect response <laughs> um <laughs> thanks to James I think uh so uh, sure enough, like my boss's boss says, like, oh, you painted your nails, I see. And then um, I'm like, yeah, you know, it's it's October 30th. You know, you paint your nails black. Holy so fuck. Uh, C-O-T-C. <laughs> I'm a DJ. Yeah, she says, okay, like, oh, you know, what's that? What is that? Like, what, is, what is that? And uh, so I, I was able to tell her, like, you know. Corn- Bro. <laughs> I love you, dude. But holy fuck, man. Oh, get it out. Get there. Bro, get oh, there, man. Oh. Oh. oh, fuck. Okay. Let's actually holy let's continue. Holy shit. But oh, not. God. And. Um, Wait, did the music just stop? It went over pretty well. That wasn't you? I think she laughed. I don't that remember. was in his video, bro. I'm, I'm sure of it. To be able to, to raise awareness. And then um, yeah. I'm like, okay, because yeah, I was like, it's all- <laughs> <laughs> bro, if that wasn't in his video and you actually, bro- that would have been so funny. <laughs> Holy shit, dude. Uh, all right, let's finish this. I like to video, imagine man. because he's, he's, he's going so long and I, do, I'm, I love you, dude. Hopefully he can take No, it. we're going to have to rewatch it. No, no. I just want to say this joke, but not at your expense. Like, I don't think you're a loser. It's just funny. It's like making fun of your friend and we, James and I make fun of each other too. Okay. He's not your I, friend. I like the idea that he put that music in there so thinking it that boring. it would complement the video really well <laughs> and that it wasn't funny at all to him. Over it's so years. funny to me. Paint your nails black to raise awareness for uh, COTC. Oh, fuck yeah. yeah. And, yep. you know, no, that's a good cause. Says, like, like, you know, what's that? That's a good cause, what dude. Is that? And we're, like, what, is, what is that? And uh, so uh, I was able to tell her, like, you know, corn on the cob. And... Um, <coughs> It went over pretty well. Let's I go. think she laughed. I don't remember. Okay. I was just go, very dude. excited to be able to, to raise awareness for COTC yep. that way. Yep. We always um, got to see everyone do your part. But yeah, no, thank you, James, for that. You're um, welcome. I love that bit. And um, Me too. Keep up the good work. Um, thank you, dude. Thanks for listening. And, um, you know, maybe, uh, maybe <laughs> October uh, 30th we can do something for <laughs> COTC awareness. <gasps> Get there. Amen, right. my brother. Bye. I love you, man. Bro, I do. the f- the fucking that was unreal, dude. That moment, that's like what I missed about this so much. Yeah. Cuz like that was just fuck. <sighs> All right, we have one last video, one last caller, and then we're going to call it we're going to call it we're raps. Gonna call the cops. <laughs> oh, fuck yeah. Oh, shit. Hey, Clay. 
Hey, James. So sick. Uh, I love you, dude. Himalayan Mountain Pass right now. Amazing. Chasing my wow. adventure filmmaking. Amazing. Dreams. I Thanks love for, you. Uh, you know, thank you for keeping me entertained and inspired through the years. Yeah, buddy. Um, you guys really, you guys kill it. I love your music play. Thank you, and, thank uh, you, bro. James, your filmmaking. Sure. I'm thank you, thank bro. you, bro. So excited where you take it next, yeah. man. But uh, yeah, thanks for uh, all the years of laughter and, and inspiration, man. Uh, best of luck to you too. Oh, dude, that guy was the fucking shit. Man. Wow. <laughs> Unfortunately, <laughs> he passed away right following a fucking avalanche. R- if you if you scroll back to the end of the video, there as he turns, you see what's coming. It's category five. We cut it for your safety. Yeah, and for YouTube, for you guys at home, that actually was. AI generated. <laughs> <laughs> so, yo, that's so sick, man. Congrats dude. that you're fucking out there on the mountain, dude. dude congrats, man. I think like uh, out- outdoor, like action photography, action videography, like oh, it's so is cool. so sick, dude. My buddy Sam from college, um, he's he was like a fucking crazy rock climber. Like he was like a freak oh, rock climber. Oh, I know about this yes. guy. So my friend Sam Crosley, he. Um, was in really tight with it. I forget the dude's name, but he's like one of the most famous. Like he was on the fucking he cam opt for free solo, which is Crazy. an Academy Award winning documentary about I've scaling the it's fucking so mountain. Good. Yeah, um, and he's like, have you seen? Does it? all that shit? I haven't seen it, bro. Got, it's so good. So I'm good. down. Thanks, Should we pull man. it up? Yeah, it's a quick forty. I think it's probably a little long. It's probably an hour and a half feature it's length. Really good. <clears throat> um, but dude, that's so sick that you're out there and that you took the time to record us a little fucking sexy one. You we know, really just a sexy it. one for the boys. We really appreciate um, and it. And we hope you, we hope that your bodies recover. And we really appreciate it. <laughs> we hope that the dogs that di- like there's dogs that do that. And we hope that the dogs that find you don't end up eating you because they're hungry Yeah, and it's cold up there too. So hopefully you didn't get too cold when you died into the snow <laughs> and hopefully you didn't get too sad when you died hopefully your god under all is, that snow hopefully your god is good and you're it's gonna die, die, die in he- heaven help, instead help, of it help. other hell instead of other hell and i just want to say to the previous guy i love you too man but that was just really funny that was so funny so oh funny. that was so funny and he knows i <coughs> hope i know i don't assume anymore Look, you guys, if you want to send us a message, uh, we prefer video, but audio is awesome too. Send it to beyond the pine. What else are we going to off to, you know? You know, <laughs> and I save them all right here on my little iPad, my big old little iPad. And he does not wash it. <laughs> Look at it. I wish he didn't. Then I'd be able to get a little bit of scut. Well, sometimes you still get a little something though. You can't get a stench off that thing. <laughs> it's more like a gasoline fume than anything. <laughs> yeah. It's, well, it's because it's gas powered, dude. Yeah. Well, James, until next week, my brother, I I want to say to you, I hope you enjoy your Pokemon card. I hope that I your do, dude. life continues. She's gorgeous. Getting better and on the path that you want it. I wish you health and wealth and all the all those bitches in the world that you've been wanting. What's going on? New York. Oh my God. Nails and stuff like that. So like, Wait, turn that one down. Turn that one down. So I come up with like... All the way down, all the way down. Previous, I have to like, f- fade it like a DJ, dude. Um, <laughs> thanks to James, Fuck. I think. Uh, so, uh, sure enough, like my boss's boss says like, oh, you painted your nails, I see. And then uh, I'm like, yeah, you know, it's, it's October 30th. You know, you, you paint your nails black to raise awareness for uh, COTC. It's fully dead. Come and, on, man, we need it. Know, she says like, like, you know, what's that? What is that? And we're like... What is what is that? And uh, so uh, I was able to tell her, like you know, I'm a cop, and. Um, <laughs>